Winston-Salem Fire Chief Trey Mayo says he thinks he knows where the Weaver plant fire started, but figuring out the origin may be a bit more complicated. I think it's going to be longer rather than shorter. Um, there, there, when, when you have that much destruction, it, it creates some challenges in, in your cause and origin determination. Um, so the, the incident in December was an overheated bearing in some piece of electrical equipment and it is remote from where we believe the point of origin is from the fire Monday night. They are uh, a, a pretty good distance away in the plant, so we do not believe that those two incidents are related. A plant employee walked by and I stopped him and I said, how much ammonium nitrate is in this facility? And he said, there are two bins in the facility and each of them have a capacity of 300 tons. So I knew that from that 10 second conversation that there were as much there was as much as 600 tons of product in the facility and within five minutes the operations chief with chief byram still on the phone with em director vernon and i we huddled and 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 it didn't take us but just a few seconds to say this is not a safe place to be we are not making any we are not making this fire any better and we made the decision uh, in that huddle to, to evacuate the plant of, of firefighters and, and establish the one mile evacuation zone. My perception is that a lot of people uh, understood the gravity of the situation and I, I don't know how we could have communicated that any more clearly than to say this is potentially one of the largest explosions. There is enough ammonium nitrate here to potentially be one of the largest explosions in U.S. history. Now, would it have been on the scale of Three Mile Island? Well, I don't know. Would it have been on the scale of the, the, the nuclear weapons that were lost off of a B-52 and down in Goldsboro back in the 60s? I don't know. But I know, but I know what happened in West Texas. I know what happened in Texas City back in. I think that that explosion was in the 40s, and I know how much product was in Western Salem, and I know there was a lot of potential there. Um, and when we got out of it, we made some good decisions, but we had a little bit of luck on our side too.